there on the schedule. Have a go? Uh, yes, please. There we go. Step up to my bar. So, 50 kilo German bomb. Okay. Unexploded. Uh, an impact time fuse. Mounted. In the plane, yep. this would be mounted in a plane. This would be fitted onto the bomb there. When the bomb was dropped, before this separated, a jolt of electricity would be sent down through there into the capacitor A. Capacitor A will be fully charged. And the descent of the bomb to the ground, capacitor A will charge capacitor B. If for any reason that distance was cut, i.e. the plane was forced down lower, the passenger B wouldn't fully charge. If it didn't fully charge when it hit the ground, it wouldn't go off. That is where you bomb. That is called a Crabtree Discharger. I'll put that in place here. Do I have to tighten that up, please? Is this going to be a, a double handed job, is it? You're going to take it in turns or you going to let Big Brother do all of it? We'll probably slap you if you take it away from them. So. Okay, right. Now then, it takes about 20 minutes for those two capacitors to bleed out. Tick, 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 time has elapsed. This is called spanner. You have a locking ring, you have a retainer. Put those two in there. One hand on top. Go ahead, sit one hand on top to hold that down. Andy clockwise to me. Over the top. There you go. That should be loose enough now for you to use your fingers. Okay. Now if you press one side down, that tilts, use your other hand. Okay, now who's, who's the pull of fuse? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Go on, which one? Pull up. You've got to pull the fuse out now. Lift it clear. Right with your hand. Hold the fuse. Okay, turn your hand sideways. This is perfectly safe, and so are you. You're holding a bomb in your hand. <laughs> I'm teaching them to be such a smarty pants, isn't it? <laughs> I'm screwed with you.